have a garbage day. Welcome back to Let's Play Donut County. I'm Burning Dog Face, and we're back in the cave. Last time, we victimized Jellybean the Chicken Farmer and Bear Claw the Beekeeper. I wonder if that honking guy on the far left even got up there. I mean, there's a ladder to his platform, but where the hell does that lead? It goes behind the donut, and we can't see anything. You know, it's funny, I've never actually had a donut with pink frosting, but it's like THE donut in pop culture. Chef, who appears to be a cat, wearing a chef's outfit. What about me? Nobody asked about me. <laughs> and Mira says, Did BK own you with a catapult, too? And Chef says, No. Mm-hmm, says BK. He ruined my restaurant, says Chef. Your restaurant stinks, says Salt. Pepper agrees, lol, yeah, it's grade D. <laughs> and Chef says, How can you guys be called Salt and Pepper and not have an appreciation for soup? Boo, says Salt. Calm down, nerds, says Mira. What did BK do to your restaurant? Well, I was dealing with a slight bug problem. I was exhausted from rounding up bugs, so I ordered a donut. It's a soup restaurant that is in the shape of a pot of soup, complete with a giant ladle sticking out the roof. <laughs> Cat soup, chef. Shout it to... Oh, where did it go? This comment from uh, Fay Otter. There it is, shout out to Fay Otter, who says... I asked ChatGPT to give me a totally real tip for the totally real game Donut County. Here is what was generated. Got it. Let's go with a totally real tip for Donut County, then. To unlock the ultimate power-up, make sure to drop exactly three pink cars, two green bicycles, and one blue mailbox into the hole before hitting the five-minute mark in level seven. No idea which level this is. This specific combination activates the secret sprinkle storm, turning everything in your path into delicious donut toppings. <laughs> the really funny thing is it's not entirely out of place in a game this ridiculous. Oh, and uh, shout out to Yornick again, who says, Fun and surprisingly scientifically true fact. If slash when humanity kicks the bucket, raccoons are one of the prime candidates to take our place. They're smart, omnivorous, love trash, which he crossed out, and have nimble little finger fingers to grab, and then it says trash again, which is crossed out and replaced with things. Oh, and Salt and Pepper split up in a sense that their musical duo split. After all, Salt doesn't look like a bird. And is Pepper's brother. <laughs> also, when I've shown real-life Mira this game, she went, "Ee! now I want to get a raccoon! So if in the nearest future Cape Town gets overrun by raccoons, you know who to blame. Me. You will have to blame me, you heartless monster. <laughs> That's silly. I like that. We're not even in the restaurant. We're outside. Oh, geez, there's a giant cockroach in under a uh, milk crate with a uh, measuring cup holding it down. And there's another one inside a milk crate that Chef is sitting on. Where am I? Oh! I was under the cockroach, which is doing its damnedest to move towards the hole. I'm not big enough to eat the cockroach, even though it keeps moving towards me. How is there grass growing out of the pavement? I don't have the catapult in this level. That's weird. Yeah, that measuring cup is broken, I'm just saying. It's falling almost a kilometer. Oh, no way, that was 999 feet, not 999 meters. Chef doesn't seem really bothered of the fact that I just... Uh, ate the thing they were sitting on and, uh, knocked them on the ground. She's just watching the hole. Hello? You okay? 
You having trouble getting it? Okay, fine. In the hole with you. Transition into the restaurant. This is new. Oh, there's another big bird here with a chef's hat on. And a bunch of cans all over the floor. Is that a mouse hole? Well, I can't go into it. Well, that doesn't make a lick of sense. I moved the hole underneath the thing dangling, dangling from the ceiling, and it tried to fall into the hole by pulling itself down on the rope and triggering a whole bunch of pulleys that poured a bucket of soup into the pot on the stove. Now there's a giant rotating rack of uh, spices with only giant salt and pepper shakers on them. I see. Now I got the salt in there, too, yes? I got soup, salt, and... Oh! A cockroach came out of the, uh, the mouse hole. It's, uh... Floating in the soup, which has turned dark green, and is, uh... I thought it was drinking it, but it's just moving up and down. Oh, it's dead. Oh, I made poison. No, don't drink! Oh! Oh, the bird didn't die. He did, however, vomit. Requiescat and Pache. I mean, it is a cockroach. So let me guess, I do that again. Let's get the salt and pepper in the hole. It's very variable how deep this hole seems to be. And I get some of this soup in here. Uh, am I missing something? Do I just eat the bird? No, I can't actually get to the bird. He's uh, standing on a tiny, tiny raised platform. I'm not seeing what I need to do. There's nothing left on the ground to eat. And there is a billboard there saying pot plus salt plus pepper. Billboard, blackboard. Let's get more soup in the pot, fill the thing. I'm gonna sit here forever, does the pot keep pouring? That's a lot of fucking soup. Maybe it doesn't count unless I do the salt and pepper after I have the soup in the pot. I mean, in the hole. Oh, yeah! Okay, it died because, uh... I didn't actually have the full recipe. Give me the salt, give me the salt, give me the salt! Yes, now it's glowing golden yellow. No, they're still dead. It's the two dead cockroaches. Oh, no, wait. Soup in pot. Soup in hole. I just gotta get the salt and the pepper. Pepper! Don't you do that. Oh, I get it! I need to make the right soup and then prevent the uh, the cockroaches from spoiling it before I can give it to the bird. He nodded a whole bunch. Oh, that's a bunch of cockroaches having a literal goddamn picnic in the back parking lot. It's weird, I left a cockroach back in there. Well, maybe he can warn the others. Tell them what you have seen. So normally I reserve that joke for when I break all but one of the skids in an area. Stupid romantic candles. Eat this food cart over here. Got this garbage can. Alright, I'll eat the... Actually, that is a skid. It's a skid with a uh, picnic blanket and, like, some... bar stools? Alright. In the whole lot goes. Eat these cars! 
Eat this tree! Eat this weird... Oh, I can't eat this weird bunker thing. But I can eat these sidewalks! And I can eat this weird bunker thing. No. Wait, tree. Oh, now we're talking. Yeah! Give me that bunker! Nom, 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 nom. Hangers are good for... Are good and good for you. Oh, well, let me have that one. Fine, I'll just go back here and see if I can get that dumpster. Oh! An apartment building just shook loose of its foundations. Now it's a physics object. I'm gonna go ahead and eat it. Sorry, everybody! There's like, gotta be like a couple hundred people in there. I didn't get any bigger. I think we're gonna that kind of thing. Let's eat, like, possibly 200 people's homes. Oh, shit! Rank up! You unlocked the quadcopter! Report to Raccoon HQ for training. I now see when I'm looking at the completed model that the uh, antennae look like raccoon ears and that there is, in fact, a section sticking up at the back that lo uh, looks like a raccoon's tail, except with purple instead of brown purple and white. I do like the big claw at the bottom, like I can pick shit up. Great delivery! Soup bowl. Soup has many health benefits if you sit in the pot long enough. Ew. Restaurant stool. Use this to reach the food. Would like to put your butt on this. Metal house. So many houses aren't made out of candy. <laughs> Cat soup. What can I say? I hate it. Oh, it's the restaurant wood platform. Why is this in the Trashopedia? Who cares? Tablecloth. Use this to wrap up your food when you're done. <laughs> Restaurant candle. Candles get better the more you have. At least 1,000 is a good starting point. Cockroach. Not a big deal. I got like a hundred of these at home. <laughs> Condiment cart. Free food! You don't even have to buy anything. I don't... Oh, oh, it's... Yes, I see. It's just ketchup and mustard and stuff. Well, there's nothing there in this image, but, you know, it's a condiment cart. Measuring cup. Turns food into math. Recipe book. It's bookmarked. Secret soup recipe. Two shakes salt, three shakes pepper. Oh! Damn, I think that was another one. One of the achievements. Make the secret soup recipe. What's annoying is I don't know that I can replay levels. It's just going on in a linear order. So I have to start a new game and make it all the way back here to do that? There was another one for beating the entire uh, uh, Gecko Park level and saving the boombox for last, called Music Lover. Like, it's a nice song. It's just really fucking loud. That's all. Restaurant crate. It's rude that I can't fit inside. Soup pot. Food only garbage can. Saucepan. Sometimes there's breakfast inside. Salt shaker. Use salt to make food taste like the ocean. Pepper shaker. Add pepper if your food tastes too good. Broth can. Soup was invented. Chef's hat. Chefs use this hat to imagine what it's like being an onion. That's silly. Chef bird. You can let a bird cook, but don't let it feed you. Ew. Birds uh, vomit into their babies' mouths when they need to feed them. <laughs> Chef's car. Honk if you were a goose in your past life. City building. Some apartments don't allow pets, but you can keep bats if you pretend to be upset about it. <laughs> That's silly. Yeah, there's no restart level button here. And, uh, no, not from the screen either. Although I do like that when I'm in this uh, great delivery screen, the pause menu says my location is... Uh? Have a garbage day. Nine hundred ninety nine feet below. Morsel says, I got food poisoning from cat soup. More than once. Co Coco says, Yeah, I used to work there. It's pretty gross. BK says, wow, haha. <laughs> Everything I do seems to have helped everyone. 
He's got a point, Mira. Maybe BK ain't so bad, says Salt. Okay, everybody, says Mira, in all caps. We all know cat soup was a hole, even before it got holed. Let's get back to the real problem here. Yeah, says BK, who's about to bring up his quadcopter. My 100% smashed quadcopter. Yeah, why did you smash it, Mira? asks Salt. Dude. I didn't want to smash it. I had to. Donut shop. I guess this is Raccoon H uh, Q. Oh, it's a first-person camera from the quadcopter. I'm not controlling anything. Except this cursor. That's uh, the cursor I have in the menus. And we're, and we're focusing on BK standing on top of a car with his tablet and Mira just staring at the quadcopter camera. Uh, across the street are some construction capybaras. And a lot of weird junk. Check this out, says BK. BK squad. Wow, says Mira. Oh yeah, and this. Wow, says Mira. Notice how the propellers spin really fast, says BK. That's how it flies. No kidding, says Mira, who I believe is playing along with him. And it only took 12 deliveries for me to get it. Can I see? Sure. She's holding on to it. Ooh. Be careful. Careful. Like this? A little lower? Hmm. She's holding it over her head now. How about this? Oh dear. It's in pieces. What are you doing? You're acting psycho! How can you brag about this stupid toy? When you got it by destroying our friends' homes! They ordered the donuts, dude. I give people what they want. Oh, the camera slightly rotates if I move the cursor like this. I forgot about that. This is pointless. BK, what's your password for this thing? Uh, I think it's 0451. Wait, no, I changed it to Bonky Kong, but with the O and, the con and Kong being a zero. Thanks. By the way, do you know what's at the bottom of the holes? I don't know. What are you doing? Teaching you a lesson. Oh no. Now it's Mira in the upper corner, and there's a hole right here. BK has already uh, crouched down and is covering his head and putting his tail between his legs. I think he sees where this is going. Now let's eat this brick. And this brick. And this brick. And now I'll... Uh, oh. Oh, that's a good one, eating that tree segment. Now I'm going to eat all these pieces of quadcopter. It was pretty cool, admittedly. I've eaten the entire path leading to the store. Oh, I see. It's a roadside thing, so there's a window and a, a bell on it. No way to pay, though. Taking all your trash. All right. Sucks to be you, BK. Trying to be foist by your own petard. Uh. Oh, now she's gonna send herself down, huh? What, like, as an act of penance? Don't mind me just eating all the little bits of grass that were left over. Except that one over there. Curse you. <laughs> it's just out of reach. Sorry, Mira, but you know it needs to be done. Oh, geez. 
she's still in the donut as it fell off the roof. Achievement unlocked. Destroy the donut shop. I think the achievement's just called Donut County. Oh, and there's the uh, the timer right there. So I'll call it right now before we actually find out what these people have to say down here at the bottom of the hole. You know, it's funny, I didn't even realize from looking at the quadcopter that it was uh, in multiple pieces. I thought she just like, smashed it with a hammer or something. I also noticed I don't see the quadcopter anymore. Didn't it used to be just behind uh, uh, the rough collie? I don't remember her name. Or his name. Whichever. Uh, I guess it doesn't really matter. In any event, I'm Burning Dog Face. I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play Donut County. And uh, you guys have yourselves a great day. Later! <laughs>